Mr. Crazy? I told you my name is Shadow Eighty. But No buts. I have no reason to go back. I deleted the copyright. So? Your fans? Ah, uh, you're right. I am. Crazy! Okay, guys, so, yeah, I'm back, and this is the last time I'm changing channels. I'm not really changing channels, we're going back to the old channel I used to have. But, no. So, seriously, guys. Um, so, yes, I did delete the copyright. Don't believe anything the video said. And, um, things weren't going well with the new channels. Um, Crazy Kirby 97 the second, Shadow Eevee 97... Bullet Bros 97, which was me and Shadow Toast just being idiots. I had one called You Choose 97. No, You Choose 2. You Choose 2. And I started one called. Okay, what was it? Um, I had one called 360 Achievements Pro. Not 360 Achievements Pro, that's my old one. The 1000 G Quests. I had one called Platinum Quests and Perfect Points Quest for anything else. And I also had a new channel I didn't really do anything with. I made it today. And it was called Headshot Gaming something. I think it was Headshot Gaming 69. Because 69 is a funny number. And, um, yeah, it just didn't work so well. I didn't like the name. Can't come up with a good name. And uh, this one there, I just thought, you know, you know what? Screw it. I had a good channel. Um, the most I've ever gotten was Shadow Eevee got 25 subscribers, that's it. So, these new channels weren't exactly popular, um, successful, any of the words you can possibly come up with. So, I basically just, you know, stick to Crazy Gravy 97, you know? Um, so that's where I'm staying. Uh, nothing new, nothing, uh, changing on this channel. Um, I deleted all the YouTube poops. Um, the ones that I still had available were moved to um, a secondary channel I have called YTP Master Kirby. I will be adding a link to that on my channel one of these days uh, when I get around to it. Um, yes, and the ones I can't acquire anymore are gone forever. Some videos were just permanently gone because they were stupid, um, copyrighted, or I just didn't want them on there anymore. Because something happened, and the video wasn't required anymore. It was some kind of update or something. For example, a contest that nobody entered because of low subscribers. And um, I don't really have those moments um, really captured anymore. And so what's left on my channel is my walkthroughs. My LPs, really. Um, my playthroughs. Um, all the episodes of Kirby and Kiwi are still there, intact, ready to go. Um, and one YouTube poop I left, I couldn't find it on um, my old computer when I tried to upload it on YTP Master Kirby, was the one called This Video Gave Me AIDS. Um, I didn't see any copyright, because the Dr. Mario theme is not really copyrighted. Um, so I can't get really in trouble for using it in a video. And it was, the video I used to match the music was my own video. I made it, so, um, if any copyright claims happen for that one, it's either Nintendo or some pretty effed up people, or I am some pretty effed up people. Okay, so let me go over the kind of things that have happened since I left my channel. Um, my Dazzle, I still have my Dazzle, it is still in one piece. Thing is, the laptop I recorded with is no longer in... Well, yeah, not now it's not in one piece. It's getting fixed. So, you will never see a Dazzle video. Um, somewhere ranging from again to until I buy myself a laptop, which will probably never happen because I'm too lazy. Hmm. Who knew? Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm actually going to show you the camera, but I can't because I'm holding it. The iPhone, yes, we are going back to the iPhone, my second way of recording. 
Um, I recently picked up a mic, so I can record voice, at least. So, um, if I ever get around to it, you'll probably see more episodes of Kirby and Kibi or something similar to that. So, yes, be excited about that. Um, if you want to see all those videos I made while I was gone, so don't think I was, like, dead, because I wasn't. Um, yeah, I was never dead to the internet. I will never be exactly leaving YouTube because I am just one of their people. Um, my, it's like one of my home websites, I guess you could say. Um, I just always felt like I belong on YouTube ever since I started it. And it's been three years now. Three years. Um, I recently had my three-year anniversary, except it didn't really count as a three-year anniversary if, um, I've been missing for five months, but I am back, um, you probably, um, you probably discovered this just recently, uh, it's been five months, you probably thought I'm far out there, you'll never see me again, you know, um, if you're an actual fan who actually likes watching my videos, but I'm going to get a few people, I, a few people I know, a few people I'm really good friends with via YouTube, to go out and help me get my channel re-publicized, I don't know. And why was it I returned, basically? Um, basically what happened is I was on my other accounts that I shouldn't really have anymore, but anyways. And I saw a few things in my channel that really startled me, um, really got my attention. When I left this channel, it had about 295 subscribers, and when I returned, it had exactly 386 subscribers. I love you guys for that. Um, 100 subscribers while I was missing. 100. That's a lot, guys. Thanks for that. I'm, I'm really proud of that one. But, um, no, that wasn't really what really startled me. What really got me feeling I should return was two things. One was that... They're making it so you can get paid half price of whatever they pay you if you're not partnered. If you want that, of course. Uh, to set up some kind of account to get the money with. Um, so I'm probably going to be doing that so I can get better supplies. Um, get a new laptop, of course, so I can do my LPs back how I used to. And all that beautiful stuff. Um, another thing is that I realized I have... This is the exact total... 35,863 views total amongst all my videos, and, dang, it's a lot, and, uh, yeah, so you guys can kind of work the math out there, so, yeah, lucky me, and that's about all, um, as a kind of returning video, I'm gonna say, um, another thing I did while I was gone, I don't know if this even counts, um, you guys probably remember about eight months back, probably a year back, I did a blind let's play of Ocarina of Time and deleted it because it was completely stupid. The videos are still up, though. I didn't really delete it. I just stopped it. I, uh... But it turns out that I actually got on that old file and through the course of about a month, two months, I actually worked my way through the game. I got up to the Water Temple and then I stopped playing for like a month, two months, three months even. And I started up again, and I started playing again. And I'm at the final boss. I never really got around to beating it, because I'm too stupid for that. I, I know what to do. It's just, bleh, I just suck at it, because I have low health. But that's how things work out. Just live with it. And, yeah, so, um, that's really something just out there to say, because um, you all remember I had that set of LPs I would always be doing over and over again. Um, you can put Ocarina of Time in that list now if you want to. Alongside, you know, Lego Star Wars, Kirby 64, Mario 64. God, I love that LP. Uh, Mario Kart 64. I still play that game. I played the hell out of that game, and it was my, my, one of my first games. And, ugh, my best game ever. And um, another game I guess you can add to the list. Um, this was done on Super Epic Walkthrough, but it's not there anymore, duh. Was, um... Uh, Conquer Live and Reloaded, the remake of Conquer, you know, that game, -y. yeah, um, I haven't played that game in, like, a few months now, and I really want to pop that thing back into the Xbox and, you know, finish her up again, 